We continue to follow the breaking news involving a school bus crash in Mobile County. About 15 students on that bus, at least three of them sent to the hospital. Yeah, it happened about two hours ago on Snow Road, just north of Airport Boulevard. Multiple ambulance were called out to that scene. Well, let's check back in with Natalie Williamson, who remains on the scene. Natalie. Well, as you can see, Lanise and Shelby, they are getting that school bus out of the ditch. They're using pits and sons. They did have to use a crane, which earlier, just a few minutes ago, that crane was standing tall, trying to pull that bus right outside of the ditch. Now, I did speak to someone at a nearby business, Franklin Automotive, which is located right in front of the crash site. They tell me the sound of the crash sounded like an explosion, and they immediately stopped what they were doing to see what happened. There's the other vehicle earlier that was involved. As we reported earlier, there was two. It was a two vehicle crash. The other one did leave on a tow truck. We are still pressing for answers on the number of injuries, but we do know there were, as you said, Lenise, 15 students on that bus. There were three that were transported to the hospital by ambulance and the bus driver. This is all according to Renee Phillips with MCPSS. Go ahead and take a look at some of this footage that we shot earlier. As you can see, the bus was inside a ditch. The front tire was forced to the side and taken off the wheel. The other vehicle involved had a cracked windshield and the front end was damaged. As you can see, looking down Snow Road, traffic is still at a standstill. It's going to be backed up for just a few more minutes as Pitts and Sun starts to clear out everything that just happened. We will continue to keep you updated live in Mobile. Natalie Williamson, Fox 10 News.